Drones have become the ultimate disruptors in modern warfare, reshaping how battles are fought. But as their dominance grows, so does the threat they pose, especially in swarms, where sheer numbers can overwhelm even the most advanced defenses. Enter China's groundbreaking Hurricane 3000, a high-power microwave weapon capable of neutralizing entire drone fleets in an instant. Unveiled at the 2024 Zhuhai Air Show, this revolutionary system is rewriting the rules of air defense. In this video, we'll uncover how this cutting-edge technology works and why it's a game-changer for global security. The heart of the Hurricane 3000 is a technological breakthrough that blends electromagnetic science with military innovation. This high-power microwave weapon uses energy waves to disrupt and destroy the electronic systems of its targets. Imagine the mechanism of your household microwave oven, but amplified 10,000 times and applied with surgical precision over a 3-kilometer range. That's the core principle of the Hurricane 3000, but its real genius lies in its sophisticated design and capabilities. The weapon operates by emitting a concentrated microwave beam that travels at nearly the speed of light. Once it locks onto a target, whether a single drone or an entire swarm, it disrupts the internal electronics, rendering them completely inoperative. Detection begins at an impressive range of six kilometers, with optical tracking enabled up to four kilometers. The effective strike range of three kilometers ensures that even fast-moving drones within this radius are neutralized before posing a threat. Unlike conventional laser systems, which require precise targeting and can struggle against larger swarms, the Hurricane 3000 employs what developers call a soft kill method. This hemispherical electromagnetic beam not only covers a wider area but also eliminates the need for pinpoint accuracy. This makes it particularly effective against saturation attacks, where hundreds of drones might descend simultaneously. Moreover, the Hurricane 3000 is an integrated system housed within a single vehicle. This mobility allows for rapid deployment across varied terrains, whether in urban centers or remote battlefields. What truly sets it apart is its reliance on electricity instead of traditional ammunition. This eliminates the need for costly missiles or resupply logistics, enabling the system to operate continuously as long as it has a fuel source for power generation. The significance of this technology becomes even clearer when considering its applications. As the Russia-Ukraine conflict has shown, drones are increasingly pivotal in modern warfare, used for reconnaissance, precision strikes, and overwhelming attacks. The Hurricane 3000 not only neutralizes these threats with unmatched efficiency, but also reduces collateral damage. Its electromagnetic pulses disable drones without physically destroying them, minimizing risks to civilians and infrastructure. The Hurricane 3000 isn't just a novel weapon, it represents a monumental leap in addressing one of the most pressing challenges of modern warfare, drone swarms. These swarms, often deployed for surveillance, attacks, or disruption, are notoriously difficult to counter. Traditional methods, like surface-to-air missiles, struggle with cost, scalability, and speed, issues the Hurricane 3000 addresses head-on. One of its most revolutionary features is its cost efficiency. Conventional counter-drone systems rely on expensive ammunition. For example, a single interceptor missile can cost tens of thousands of dollars, and even advanced laser systems demand considerable resources. The Hurricane 3000, however, uses high-power microwaves fueled by electricity. This design not only eliminates ammunition costs, but also ensures uninterrupted operation. As long as the system has power, it can continuously defend against threats, making it invaluable in prolonged combat scenarios versatility is another major advantage. The Hurricane 3000 is designed to counter not only individual drones but also large-scale saturation attacks. Its soft kill approach, using electromagnetic waves to disable electronics, is far more effective in these situations than traditional kinetic methods. Unlike systems that physically destroy targets, the Hurricane 3000 disables them by frying their circuits, leaving the surrounding environment unharmed. This feature makes it especially suitable for urban combat and scenarios where collateral damage must be minimized. Additionally, the Hurricane 3000's mobility is a game changer. Traditional air defense systems are often bulky and stationary, making them vulnerable to attacks or unsuitable for rapidly changing battlefields. In contrast, 
this microwave weapon is integrated into a single vehicle, allowing for easy transportation and quick deployment in diverse environments. Whether defending a critical urban center or a remote outpost, the system is ready to respond at a moment's notice. Its effectiveness against swarms is particularly crucial. Drone swarm tactics, where hundreds of drones operate in coordination to overwhelm defenses, have become a significant concern in modern conflicts. The Hurricane 3000's wide coverage area and instantaneous response capabilities make it one of the few systems capable of neutralizing such threats efficiently. The introduction of the Hurricane 3000 marks a pivotal moment in global defense technology, signaling a shift toward energy-based weapons and a new era of electromagnetic warfare. This high-power microwave system doesn't just neutralize drones, it redefines how militaries approach air defense and electronic warfare, setting a precedent that could shape military strategies for decades. One of the most immediate implications is the impact on global arms development. With China showcasing such an advanced system, other nations are likely to accelerate their efforts in electromagnetic weapons. The Hurricane 3000's ability to counter drone swarms at a fraction of the cost of traditional systems will undoubtedly prompt countries to reevaluate their reliance on expensive missile-based defenses. This could lead to a broader adoption of cost-efficient, electricity-powered systems, reducing dependency on conventional munitions. The system's mobility and versatility also challenge the status quo. Many existing air defense solutions are fixed or semi-mobile, limiting their effectiveness in rapidly evolving combat scenarios. The Hurricane 3000's vehicle-mounted design ensures adaptability, making it suitable for a variety of operational environments. This could inspire a wave of innovation in modular and mobile defense systems, prioritizing flexibility over static installations. Ethically, the development of the Hurricane 3000 raises critical questions about the future of warfare. While its soft-kill approach reduces physical destruction and collateral damage, the technology could be repurposed for other uses. For instance, electromagnetic weapons capable of disabling drones could theoretically be adapted to disrupt civilian infrastructure or communications systems during conflicts. This highlights the need for international regulations to govern the deployment and use of such technology, ensuring it remains a tool for defense rather than a means of escalation. Strategically, the Hurricane 3000 underscores the growing importance of drone warfare in military planning. The Russia-Ukraine conflict has already demonstrated the effectiveness of drones in reconnaissance, targeted strikes, and psychological operations. With the introduction of systems like the Hurricane 3000, the battlefield is becoming increasingly dominated by electronic and energy-based engagements. This evolution could lead to a greater focus on developing counter-electronic warfare measures, creating a technological arms race centered on energy and information. The Hurricane 3000 isn't just a weapon, it's a glimpse into the future of warfare. By combining cutting-edge technology with practical efficiency, it addresses one of the most pressing challenges of modern combat, the rise of drones. But its significance goes beyond its immediate capabilities. It represents a shift towards smarter, more sustainable military solutions, where precision and cost efficiency take center stage. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on space exploration and scientific discoveries. And don't forget to leave a comment below. Also, you can visit our website, spaceinews.com. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.